so the first circuit what we are looking at is resistor transistor logic uh, which comes under bipolar saturated version uh, rtl that is resistor transistor logic now resistor transistor logic as it says the circuit will be using resistors and transistors only for logic design okay the basic gate here is nor gate why nor gate because it is a universal gate if you have a basic gate nor gate uh, you can design any other gate right because it's a universal gate uh, why not nand gate i don't have answer for that uh, that's what it comes with resistor transistor logic has basic gate nor okay that's the basic element even if you have to design not gate you have to use the nor gate only okay so that's why there is one single basic gate and that will be used for creating other gates uh, so that's why uh, inside ic you can imagine this kind of circuit and uh, it will be replicated uh, depending upon the kind of gate you want okay so nor gate is the basic gate in rtl now let's see how it looks so vcc ground rb rb rc trans transistor t1 transistor t2 this is how they are in connected in parallel this is a standard circuit you have you, you should be knowing that okay in rtl this is the nor gate this is the basic gate and if you have to design any other gate you have to use this one okay so you have two inputs a and b and output is a plus b bar that is nor output okay how it will work uh, since two inputs are there the combination will be 0, 0, 0, 1, 1, 0, 1, 1, right and how transistor works in saturation or on state and cutoff or off state uh, we have discussed this in switching circuit right if you apply uh, at the input of transistor logic one ib current will be flowing through it uh, the base more the ib current more will be the ic as well if you have more ic the vc will be less vc will be less ultimately it goes beyond uh, below vb and it makes collector base junction forward bias okay so forward bias forward bias it makes the transistor saturation and uh, when uh, you when you will apply logic zero there won't be any current flowing through the base hence there won't be any current flowing through collector means it is as good as off okay so cutoff region so that's how transistor works in bjt transistor works in on off state okay that's we have discussed all, already in certain in switching devices video so same thing you can apply here uh, so it's inverted type if you will apply logic one your um, transistor will be uh, uh, will be in saturation hence you will be getting off output so it's inverter type right we are all have seen this so if i'll apply zero zero uh, in uh, in both the inputs what will happen to both the transistors they will be in cutoff right zero zero means no currents will be passed in both the current transistors hence no ic will be there it is as good as off so all the output will be vcc right the output will be vcc means high right or i'll write it as one and transistors will be off 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 okay now if you'll apply zero one means this guy is zero this guy is one means this will be in saturation this will be in cutoff so there won't be any connection you can think of here there will be connection like this because vc will be almost equal to zero so that's why output will also be zero right in this case what happens t1 is off t2 is on now same thing if you'll apply here one and here zero this guy will be on and this guy will be off the output will be again zero because of this and if you apply both one one both will be in saturation means there will be a connection like this and this so directly output will be connected to ground so you can see this is an expression these guys are input a and b y is your output you can see it's a expression of nor gate why because if both of them are zero then only output is high if any of any one of them is high the output is low right so this is the nor gate uh, resistor transistor logic that's the only uh, circuit you will have here and uh, if you have to use the 
uh, if you have to let's say make a not gate then you have to connect nor gate like this right nor gate you connect like this both the inputs you connect together to some this uh, input variable and y will be a bar means like these two guys you connect together and you provide a single input at the output you will get a bar okay and if you have to make or gate you have to just provide an inverter uh, in front of this the inverter will be made like this uh, whatever i have made uh, just now so ultimately what i want to say is you will use only nor gate as a basic gate in register transistor logic so that to design or other gates okay and this is the standard circuit now what are the characteristics of this uh, resistor transistor logic i will tell you uh, like what is the fan out what is the power dissipation propagation delay what are the advantages disadvantages all these we will see now let's look at the characteristics advantages and disadvantages of a resistor transistor logic you can see here uh, i've written the characteristics that is the basic gate you can have here is nor gate only uh, with the help of nor gate you have to design other gates fan out is uh, around three which is very uh, low uh, it's not good it should be greater than five is considered better uh, tpd is very high 50 nanoseconds around uh, if it is around 30 or or less uh, 10 nanosecond or something like that then it is better pd is also high 10 milliwatt around or 12 milliwatt sometimes and uh, the product of this you can see 500 picojoule fom the the uh, the lower is uh, is better uh, noise margin is also 0.2 volt uh, you are getting very less margin uh, among among inputs and output voltage so basically these are the uh, the the uh, characteristics of this resistor transistor logic the advantages are it provides wired end logic wired end means uh, you take the output of one nor gate uh, output of another nor gate if you connect in this fashion it's called wire ended means you are connecting the two wires like this the output you will get is end of the two uh, these two okay so this is uh, this is an advantage provided in uh, resistor transistor logic now the disadvantages are like same uh, low noise margin it is around 0.1 and 0.2 so you can have other logic families where you will have better noise margin uh, poor fan out uh, should be typically more than five uh, so it is here three so it's not good tpd is high uh, means like propagation delay is high power dissipation is high so it's it was starting logic family that's why after this a uh, lot of logic families came and with the improvements so slowly and gradually you will see all the characteristics and i'll compare them uh, you will be able to see the change okay so some will take very less um, time some will have very high fan out so that's why we have studied these characteristics so that we can compare these logic families and advantages and disadvantages are anyway uh, it's obvious you use you, you can see that why we are studying okay now let's move on to the next uh, logic family so that uh, you will get uh, much better idea about these things okay 